Hi besties, um, it's your girl China Sugar Doll Plants and I am back with a February kit lineup and yes I am aware um, I'm like a whole week late. Your girl was sick um, and just had a lot of stuff going on, just didn't get really a lot of time to film. So that's what's going on but um, I did start to already film this and then like accidentally hashtag exposed where I live. Although if you've ordered from my shop you could probably like, I don't know, try to figure it out or look at my stories please don't do that um <laughs> i'm not worth figuring that out for but anyways i just want to show you guys um so first things first um we have snowbound here from scribble prince co and i love the colors and i did have the extras for quite a long time since like last year when this kit first came out but i just recently got the kit and you guys will see that in my haul well you should have seen it if you've already watched my haul Sorry, clearing my nasal cavity because your girl is still getting over sick. So we have Snowbound. And I just want to say, it is not a snowy, fun little mood here. Um, we am covering where I live. Uh, this is the weather where I live. It is, like, very mild. Like, let me tell you. Today, the low is 27. It was cold. But the high is 51. Tomorrow, the high is 59. The high on Thursday is 62. The high on Friday is 60. Then we're back down to 47, 45, 51, 56, then 64, then 62. We are, in like, in the mildness. And usually, this is the worst time of winter for us. So, this is very interesting. Um, so, like, in my head, because of the past, like, February, we usually get, like, snowstorms and stuff like that. I thought, like, that was going to be the vibe here. But, no, literally, Austin, Texas. I don't know what you guys are doing. Are you guys drunk? Not you, but, like, the weather, I guess, in Austin. Are you drunk? Because, like, why are you getting snow and ice storms? And we're literally getting, like, we got snow for, like, all of, like, we got snow overnight and it wasn't a lot and it literally melted like within less than eight hours and then we had snow for like five minutes and that was it but anyways i'm just gonna pretend it like i'm just gonna phone it in um so we have snowbound here um by spc and i am pairing it with this like sparkly gold foil from uh caress press so we have this like snowflake i will show that in a second it's technically champagne lights um, so we have the blue freebie, we have the 15 millimeter washi, we have the fashion girls add-on. Um, this is pre-doodles, but I'm sure I have plenty of doodles that probably match. And then we have our full boxes, extra full boxes. This is an old format with the heart checklist. And then we have doodle, like decos, why was I saying doodles? Deco, flags, work labels the like day previews and the weekend script banner and then we have glitter headers headers habit trackers movies three heart checklists and the little label there it's so weird to see old formats when you get new kits then we have these here which i sometimes miss and then we have these um rounded labels these deco little stickers and the flags and then we have our solid labels I love the colors and then we have the um pattern labels and then we have the bottom washi which I love and this little box you could put a quote box although I don't have one um but if you wanted to you could I'm not huge on quote boxes though so it's not a big deal to me so that is snowbound and that is for the week that I'm currently in which is the six and I'll show you guys the foil let's open her up so we have this champagne lights, although it's not called champagne lights at Caress Press, but this is snowflakes and we have it in the newer format and there's a tall box, although I don't have a tall box, so I'm going to probably cut that. Um, and then we have the headers, we have the bottom washi, the hole protectors, the fancy headers on the side, like I use on the sidebar, and then date dots and then deco and then scripts, icons and um, bigger icons and a weekend script. And then the bottom wash, not bottom washi, the bougie boxes. So, or underlays, whatever you wanna call them. What's the difference? <laughs> I don't know. So that is for the week that I'm currently in, even though it's like very warm. <laughs> Makes very little sense. I almost am tempted to move stuff around, but we're just gonna go with it. Okay, so then 
this next coming week is Valentine's Day. This is for the week of, I believe, the 13th. Yes. And I'm using this kit from um, Pink Diamond Planner Co. called Valentine's Day. We are doing mixed metal with champagne lights and sparkly red. I know it's going to be a lot. I almost feel like I should use like a solid red because of like the champagne lights like one or the other has to kind of happen like it needs to be solid gold and champagne lights or sparkly red and champagne lights but I'm gonna be extra it's Valentine's Day we're allowed to be extra okay so first things first we have the kit and you guys should have seen me flip through it in my haul which went live before so I won't spend too much time you know this is kind of like my encouragement of like go watch my haul if you want to see these kits like me talking in detail about them but um I kind of already said in my haul, but I'll say it again here. This is going to be more of the vibe for Valentine's Day than, like, the going out to eat vibe. I just didn't feel like trying to find a restaurant. I love sushi. Um, and we're going to try to get takeout at my favorite. Um, and just, like, get a little um, strawberry shortcake. And I know my fiancé ordered some goodies. And I've ordered his gift. I hope it's on its way. And I have, like, another thing that I found, like, that I had never given him, so that is also on its way. Um, but, yeah, it's going to be, like, more of an indoors, like, cozy little vibe for Valentine's Day. And then also we're going to see a movie the day after Valentine's Day. We're going to see Kaguya-sama, Love, Love is War, I almost said Art is War, <laughs> Love is War, The First Kiss Never Ends, which is, like, an anime, like, animated, um movie from an anime that we watched and we've also been reading the, ma the mangas i have the first book and then the rest i got from the library and now i'm in a rush to try to like finish them all before they're due which is this coming week so that's fun um but they're they're not hard to read so i think i should get through it so we have this freebie here and then we have the um fashion uh two we have the fashion kissing medium i'm probably gonna use this one Although my fiancé does not have black hair. He has brown hair. But he's also not tan, so we're not <laughs> putting him with that. Um, he is very pasty. And he's my little pasty white Pillsbury Doughboy. I'm just kidding. I love you, honey. Don't listen to this. Um, so then <laughs> we have Fashion Date Medium. And I'm probably going to use this one. Although she doesn't really look like me. And I don't really look like my fiancé, but it's the closest. And then we have the labels. And then we have the doodle add-on. <clears throat> I love the color so much. And in the past, I did used to go, like, go get stuff at Victoria's Secret, you know, get spicy. But we're just in our loungewear. Like, we're just chilling. And then we have um, this sampler just came with this order. So it's a like date night, bath, Starbucks, and then, like, the hearts. So I figured I'd add that into here just to pull in. And then we have some uh, underlays from SPC. We have sparkly red and sparkly uh, what is it? champagne lights I mean in both the hearts and the valentine I know I won't be able to use all of them so it's okay and then we have the sparkly red hearts foil bundle which I picked up it was not a newer one it's from last year but I've used it before too I think for valentine's day so we have the sparkly red hearts and um they have our bougie, which I'll probably just pull out and put to something else. Scripts and icons, and then hearts, and then deco, and bottom washi, and this, uh, these headers, and the dates. So, that is the foil situation. I definitely feel like I want to pull in, like, more champagne lights, if possible, instead of just having it all mostly be relying on the underlays. Like, I'll try to find some more champagne lights, um foil to pull in oh i don't think there's a lot of heart one heart pattern so we shall see so that is for the week of valentine's day it doesn't want to like fit in there oh my god hold on i think like one of these is like cut too tall and i have to trim it let me see yeah one of them is kind of cut no I don't know let me see okay that one in I just had I probably have to piecemeal it so that one in 
And then we have the extras. And those are fitting, yep. So that fit. And then we have the doodles. And then we have foil. Oh, that doesn't go. That's for that goes in a different pocket that I was just too lazy to put in before I started filming. So that is the week of Valentine's Day. And I might start having like lineups for something you guys should have seen in my haul. And I guess I'll keep that as an incentive for you to go watch my haul. Like a different type of planner. So go check that out. So then we have Heartbreaker from SPC. And I had this from last year. So I should have all the extras and everything. I didn't have room for it last year because I had already bought other kits or kits that I felt fit more. So this year we're using her finally. And I was going for like a mixed metal moment. So we'll have to try to do that. Like Lux Hearts because I usually saw people use like Lux Foil with this kit. So first things first, we have our full boxes and we have this extra hand box where they're painting their nails. It's just so chic and gorgeous and just a vibe. And then we have this little cat and the little cloud tote and the flowers. And I just figured I wasn't trying to do like a bunch of love, but um, like multiple love kits, I was fine with just doing one. But since I already had it, I didn't feel like spending money on like another kit. Um, that was more like wintry or any time and so I was just like I'm just gonna use this now and get it over with not to get it over with I do really love this art and I would pick it up again if it ever got like re-released you know next year or something but I was just like I'm just gonna use it like I waited a whole year I love little hearts pattern the heart like cherry pattern let me have this page here um I thought I had extras. I'm sure maybe I didn't get the 50 millimeter because I was gonna use bottom wash, like a simply gilded washi. Or no, here it is. Here it is. Okay, so the 15 millimeter washi, and we have um, the uh, label sampler. So I'll put those in the back and put this away so I can go over the foil. So we have a lot of stuff going on with foil. So first things first, we have these. Um, Lux underlays that are in gold. We have, I pulled in, I put this in the like thing just so I can find it easier. The icons and the um, scripts in mixed metal, gold and silver, and then we have some leftover Lux. And then we have these Lux overlays in gold. I probably won't bring them in because I already have these in gold and silver, so I can take that out. Um, so let me open this. <clears throat> so here we have the overlays and the headers two sets of those and then we have the mixed metal gold and silver bougie and then we have the icons and scripts and the um weekend banner and then we have the bottom washi and the headers the deco the dates and the um symbols letters icon whatever so then I decided to pull in some additional Valentine stuff to like make it more Valentine's-y. So we have these hearts, deco hearts from SBC. We have these Sadie Stickers heart mini garland. We have the heart dangle garland from Sadie Stickers. We have this uh, deco sheet from Scribble Prince Co. We have this gold hearts um, overlays. Something stuck on there. Oh, it's stuck on the back there. That's funny. Oh my god. And then we have these hearts gold um, underlays that I wanted to bring in either one or two or both we'll see maybe it'll be like a three different types of underlays moment we'll see and then we have these icons and um, they were from a caress press bundle like deco and then we have these heart string lights kind of almost or just heart dangles over box over box full box overlays from Sadie stickers from a long time ago and this caress press um, extra um, the thing of, uh, uh, from a foil bundle that I cut up to put into, like, sections in my seasonal 
organization. So that is the week of, um, let me see, the week, it would be the week of the 20th. And it's like giving like kind of like my preparation vibes for um, going to Colorado because I'm trying to be like that girl and just be cutesy and everything. So that's what we have there. And then last but not least for the week of the 27th for going to Colorado. <laughs> We have Frosty from Scopa Prince Co. Some Kittenish Jess art. This is very, besides the first two weeks, the second two weeks are Kittenish Jess heavy. So, um, so first things first, let's open this up. This is obviously a newer kit and I loved seeing how everyone's used it. I'm so excited to use it. Um, I was going to try to use it earlier in the month, but then I decided to push it and just use it because it's still giving like lovey vibes. Like of this little bucket here I guess it's like giving like winter getaway with like your boo but I'm going for a work trip and my mom's coming along so I like the seek magic every day little cup and then the, mar the marshmallows and the girl with her hair and everything and the little book um, but this this is just such a gorgeous scene it reminds me so much of like Colorado but also reminds me of Utah um, so yeah I've never been to Utah and I've never really been to Colorado I've been there in like a layover when I went to Disneyland when I was like nine or eight so yeah so we have that and then we have the deco and the three heart checklist and the like weekly overviews the flags and the weekend script banner then we have these extra full boxes marquees these um i forgot how she calls these but these little labels that are like shaped and then we have the gorgeous glitter header color and the habit trackers and then we have this page of labels where they're mixed with square and rounded and really small rounded and whatnot and then we have the little things and then the bigger little things i just really love the colors and then we have um our solid labels our pattern labels um the box of waffles i love waffles and then i love this like ombre kind of like bottom washi 15 millimeter not bottom washi yeah is it called bottom washi or is it just called washi anyways it's 15 millimeter washi um and then we have the, um, I think this is the fashion. And then we have the doodles. And then we have fam two, which I'll probably use this one. And I was going to like Franken these two, this one with this one, which is why I got this one. Um, I might still, even though my fiance is not coming, it's just being me and my mom. And then we have the uh, extra freebie with the waffles. So that is um, frosty. And then let me put it away so I can showcase the foil. Come on. Although I should probably put these back in cellos because I didn't take a thumbnail pick, but it's whatevs. So here's some foil I pulled out. I had this Planner Pixie Co. Snowflake Tall Box um, that I print and cut and foiled last year and then we have these coat boxes but first hot cocoa there's no place like home let it snow and then walking in winter wonderland i think i'll do the but first hot cocoa and then i have these from planner pixie from a foil printable foil bundle i did i have these headers from svc i might not need to really even bring them in because i have two foil bundles right here but we have some more headers i just like to have options and then i have these as well and then a sparkly hollow ones and then we have two crest press foil bundles i'm gonna do like a manual mix metal not manual because i don't like to pick up <laughs> each little sticker and cover over it but um we'll do silver and a uh, sparkly hollow so at first i was gonna do sparkly hollow in the like gold snowflake one that's in the beginning the champagne lights snowflake but i decided to do the silver and the sparkly hollow so i'm not going to show both they're the same Mm, are they the same? No. This one's newer, and this one's probably older. Okay, so I'll go through both. So we have this page here, have this page here. The bottom washi is so cute. The scripts and the icons, and then the bougie boxes. I am going to be making some snowflake underlays for this, so sorry I don't have them ready now. I just really wanted to get this video filmed for y'all, make some content. And then this one is from 
I believe, last year because the icons look, yep, and so do the scripts. They look older. Um, but we have this freebie um, there. And then we have the sparkly hollow snowflakes. And then we have bottom wash. She had hers, more headers, and deco. And this is a have the bougie boxes, so I can just make some snowflake ones and sparkly hollow. And we have work, scripts, whatever, icons, whole reinforcers, and date dots. So it was a mini foil bundle, so it didn't have the bougie. Or maybe I already used it. I don't know. I don't think I would have. But yeah. So that is everything for my February 2023 lineup. Um... I'm going to make a little placeholder, like on my hands right here. Hold on. Let me put this away. Come on. Eh. I'll close this. I'm scared to pinch myself. Okay. So right here, I'm going to be putting what the monthly should hopefully look like, what I've decided to do. At first, I was going to do the star-crossed art in a monthly from okay plans but i'm thinking i'm gonna go with pillow because i really like that art i am gonna buy the kit to hoard um for like an anniversary valentine's day next year depending on the art whatever um so we'll be getting that art as a kit but i wasn't able to use it this year and i didn't like the colorway that the crest press um one was in so i'm going to just get the planner pixie purple one and go forth with my life so i'm gonna put a little placeholder it'll be right there but yeah guys um or should have already seen it because i would have put it up while talking about it because it doesn't make sense to put it up after talking about it so you can see what color it is but anyway guys um it's a short month compared to january um i think that was everything let me see um the 6th the 13th the 20th and the 27th and technically 27th feels more like march um, but I will be in Colorado the whole entire week for work. And I'm kind of sad because there's Go Wild happening here in D.C. And I was so excited when they announced it. And then also my job was like, hey, like, so um, this work conference that we're, you know, hosting and you guys are going to is like that same week. So that's what happened. But it's okay. I will. It was very expensive and I was not willing to pay that much. Um, I mean, granted, I wouldn't have had to pay for like hotel or like travel, but um my friend, she's working, Cindy, she's working on winning tickets, and if she, <laughs> if she gets multiples, I'll be like, please bring me, but, um, no, I, I'm gonna be, like, getting in Friday the 3rd, and the, the Go Wild starts, like, Thursday, and so I'll miss a whole entire day, like, I'm not gonna pay all that much money to, like, miss a whole entire day, and miss another day Friday, I would really only be able to go Saturday, because Friday I get in at, like, 9 o'clock at night, so I will try to see if there's, like, people who are going, if you are going to go wild and you'll be in the D.C. area, maybe I can meet up with you um, and say hello and give you a hug, go to lunch, dinner, whatever. I don't know. I would definitely want to see people, um, but I just can't afford that. And I did want to go to the shop summit, but I don't know. Um, I've been brainstorming stuff for shop stuff. I haven't had the capacity to do my shop. I don't know what my life's going to look like, so... But I'm just putting it out there. If you guys see me make an announcement soon or something, you know, just keep me on your thoughts because I do want to do my shop. There's so much stuff that, like, I really loved, especially my Disney stuff that I wanted to do. And I'm still working on it in the background. But, yeah, that's it, guys. Um, <laughs> the tangent came out of nowhere. I'm very sorry for that. But, yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Please remember to like. Um, <laughs> so, like, comment, subscribe click the bell to forget to get notifications every time I upload and um that is it y'all I will talk to you guys in my next video I love you guys so much bye